Hi everyone. So today we are going to hex mesh this solid part, and uh, I am using HyperMesh 23, the new interface. Uh, firstly, I want to show you that this is firstly not a mappable solid. Mappable solid, I will show you what is mappable solid like. Uh, I will create one geometry, and then you can see the difference what is mappable solid and what is not. So this is a mappable solid. If I have to know, uh, the, it is very simple. If you go to map, this color means it is a mappable solid, and this type of color means it is a not a mappable solid. So we will convert this into a mappable solid, and then we will do uh, use this map option to quickly do the hexamesh. Okay. So firstly, I will delete this solid. Yes. Okay, now as you can see that this is a reflectable part, uh, it is symmetrical, so I will quickly uh, split it. So I am using F11 option and then I am using plane. Okay, uh, my target will be solid. Okay, and now simply pay. Uh, I'm changing this. Okay, review split. Okay, now so I will hide one part of the solid. Okay, and now I will play with this one. Okay, so again I need to separate this. So how I can do? I will use surface options. Target is again solid, and tool is now surface cutting. Plane cutting tool is surface. I will extend the trimmer and I will review this. This is looks fine. I split it. Okay. Now again, I need to split this face, this face to make it completely uh, mappable solid. Okay. For hex mesh. Okay. I will use this surface. I can use also this surface. I can review this. Okay, split it. Okay, so this part I think it becomes mappable. I will check it. Okay, so go to map, and you can see that this part is mappable. This is this is and this two becomes mappable. Firstly, I will try to mess this. Okay, so mess it. So as you can see that some 2D mess has been generated. I don't want try in my 2D mesh as it will become a penta in 3D mesh. So what I will do is I will uh, I will increase this seed and I can increase this seed. Okay. Now I can increase this I think. Yeah. Okay, now this looks fine. Only one try is there. Let it be. Click on mess. So hex mess has been created. For others also, just go and click. Click. Ah, oh, sorry. Mess. So one structure 2D mess has been created. Now go to mess. Okay. So this part has been messed. Okay. So I will save this one for the time being, and now I can proceed again. So uh, this part is again uh, reflectable. Let's try this. I don't think I can get it in one click. Let's see. Mm, yeah, it looks fine. Let's see this. Okay, it is not getting messed. Okay, so again I will make some splits here. Go to F11, surface, solid, and tool is this one, and sorry, this one. Okay, review it, split it. Okay, okay, now let's see 3D map so 
so this looks fine let's mess it okay got it now this also looks fine I can easily mess this one yeah it looks good done now rest is this one is pending so again I will split this one using surface options target is again solid and tool is surface so review it yeah and split it now go to map okay mm, okay one try will come let it be okay okay now it is hex mess has been created now i will show you that i think there are no 2d mess here yeah a part of 2d mess is there i will delete this okay okay now 3d mess is created that is hex mess so I will uh, do, just do one check like whether it is properly connected or not okay so I will uh, extract the faces now I will uh, find out the free edges so free edge is there let's see there are no free edges okay what about T connections I will find out the T connections there are no T connections so I can delete this face that means my hex mess is correct okay now as we know that we have reflected it now we need to reflect it so I will go to a mirror option and choose sorry choose the all the elements and so preview so it is not I need to select proper plane now so this plane I have selected mm, I need to reflect it about x-axis so I am using this one okay where is my mirror lying it is lying here but I need it here Again, I am choosing plane and I am choosing this one. So now I have set it here 25.5, 22.5. Now keep original and so preview. Let's see. is on uh, yeah I need to equivalent this nodes also yes so review and you can see this one so this needs equivalencing equivalence okay now I will check check again the free edges no free edges found sorry I need to extract the faces and now I need to extract the free edges free edges the T connections are not there T edges are not there free edges are also not there so I can uh, delete this face and hex mess is completed you can see this 
Okay. So this is how you can do the hex mapping. Thank you.